What's up, Stanky Dank Tanks? And okay, y'all, since y'all getting on the shorty nerves, on the shorty nerves, on the shorty do nerves, what I'm gonna do is an old time sake read. A what? A old time sake read. A who? A burning a midnight oil read back when we was in what? 2018, right? When we all came together. When we all became. Uh, messed up about the weather <laughs> the weather and now we was gonna come up out of the glitch right <laughs> cause we wasn't with that shit we wasn't for none of it cause it wasn't for us to do right <laughs> let me stop <laughs> I'm about to get my print sound right I told you this was back when we was in the day Right, back in the days when we was trying to praise and figure out how to get out of them crazy ways, right? Woo, make mm, like them dudes with them attitudes that was rude and crude and we ain't know what to do, right? Mm-mm, nah, 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 shoddy do, right? What we got, because when I came through, I came true, and what we do? Had to separate from who, <laughs> right? And we became the one house of cards. We roll and rock and re-hard. So, with that being said, let me hit you with the old school to October, November, December. Well, November, December. 2018, stank a like, how we do, right, going back for you, right, so what do we have here, we got, oh, that's fading, mm. these even the cards that I was using, well, I had different cards, but, you know, um, this, these are my Botticelli's, right, this is the seven of, um, swords, we got the seven of swords, we got judgment, we got five of cups, star card, ace of wands, five of pentacles, emperor, and the page of swords, right, what we seeing here was very clear and the page of wands right page of wands justice hangman uh-uh and the ace of pentacles see what we saying oh and the chariot uh-uh right we had to take it way back we went way back to the beginning when things was tight on us when things was hard on us when people was coming at us we didn't know what was going on in our life right we didn't know what was going on right all we knew is that we had met somebody and they say, you know, we all caught up, right? We all got trapped up in some craziness. How we get trapped up in that, right? Right. Looking for love in all the wrong places. Looking for love. Right. Don't be looking for love. Love should, right. Mm -mm. Right. Love should have brought you home, but it didn't. Love should have found you, and it did. And it wasn't the right type of love, right? It was that lusty love because of them wands, right? Them magical wands, right? We had a bunch of young-minded people surrounding us right trying to bring us down with that black magic correct correct more correct right these people was wild and crazy right and we had to fight our way out right this worked both ways we had to fight our way out of their trap six of swords right we had to fight our way out because these people was nothing but greedy people and wanted to take from us whatever they could get from us they didn't care about us they didn't want to floss us they just wanted to take from us, right? They made it look good, but they made it look good. But under that, what nothing but them wands, boy, what nothing but that black magic, and we had to get our asses away, right? Because for them, it wasn't about love at all. It was all about money, all about money, shelter, food, clothes, whatever they can get out of you. Because that's what it's wanting to do. They want to get whatever they can get out of you, and that's what that. That's what we got trapped up into. Um, we in November, December 2018 energy. Right, house of cards, right. And then what else we was? Right, right, what else we was? We was divine masculine, divine feminist at this time. We didn't know no better, right. Right, we was house of, divine masculine, divine feminist, but we separated ourselves and were, was house of cards, right. Right, with this eight. We had to separate ourselves because a new crew came in, right? And it caused total havoc, right? And some real stink energy came in and caused some serious havoc. And that's when the twin flame thing switched to divine masculine, divine feminine. I'm sorry, we were twin flames at that time, not divine masculine, divine feminine. We were twin flame, right? Right. And then that stink energy came in. That stink energy came in and changed everything, right? And what did we ended up being? 
that we ended up the jargon changed to divine masculine, divine feminine, and that's where we fell into the wrong category. We were okay when we were twin flames. The minute we did what took on that new energy, the minute we took on that new energy, it messed us all the way up, right? It took us higher than what we were supposed to go. It took us to another level than what we were supposed to go. We were never supposed to be divine feminines, right? Twin flame, everybody already knew about, right? Twin flame, everyone has known about. Divine feminine, uh-uh, right? That's that spook, right? That took, take, makes you think you're supposed to be above the law, everyone else, life, God, right? That, that takes you to a level of away from God. That, that takes you away from God, right? That card, right? And it's how you end up feeling, right? And this is what you end up doing, having all these voices chasing behind you. You lose your mind, you feel alone, your butt stinking in the wind, and then you're full of all these energies and, and voices and people trying to come at you. We all went through this phase. This is what they call the dark night of the soul. This right here. Right. All for what? Some dude or some chick that did what? Put a stank ass spell on you because they want to trap you up with a kid and keep you in their life the rest of their life. Right. They want to have a commune. Right. Trap you up with children and keep you in their life. For the rest of their life and have that polygamous life because most of them are what base they are a lot of them are yeah they study that right they study that sure do they study bayism i don't know what it's called but it's bayism to me right and then they have you all totally confused and tripping because you don't know how in the world you got into some spell stuff Right. Now you seeking out spell stuff, trying to figure out how to get these spells off of you. <laughs> right. You're seeking out spell stuff, trying to figure out how to get spells off of you. And that's how you end up learning the dirty, dirty. Because you want to beat this person's behind. But guess what? They so sneaky. You don't know they're doing black magic. But you know something happened to you. Because God to gives you a notion to check into certain things. Like with me, I was sent the notion on the tarot cards to let me know that there was a tarot card reading done on me. Right. Right, but this was just a strong arm you into right into ultimately being what wild, crazy, weird, and doing black magic right along with their crazy behinds. Right, 2018 energy. Right, this is us in 2018 since the world want to be in our business. Right, since the world trying to be in our business. Right, so what do we have to do? We was hearing all kinds of spiritual stuff, so we loped up together. God sent us to each other. God sent us to each other. God sent Nala me. God sent his uh, his alpha lion, it's me, Nala, with an H, to the underworld, right? He sent me to the underworld to give y'all the message, right? To decipher the, the system. Yes, God sent me there because he loves you to decipher the system of this divine masculine crap that we were going through. Because we all knew that divine masculine crap because it's what they look like, porno thugs. <laughs> They, we was promised kings. Nah, they was porno thugs, right? <laughs> Who wanted to lock us down with their little ugly glass kids? <laughs> they wanted to lock us down with their ugly glass kids, right? Mm mm. Cause they knew we knew how to make money, right? They wanted to lock us down with their ugly glass kids. The dudes wanted to get us pregnant, and the women wanted to get pregnant by the dudes, right? Right. And the women, right. They promised, you know, they thought this is what the dudes look like before the voodoo chicks got them. Once the voodoo chicks got them, they ended up looking like this. All oh, huh? Porno thugs. Right, right, right. So that fox hounds was looking like this. World was over with. Yep. The fox hounds was looking like this in the beginning. Messed around with them stank chicks and ended up like this. Right. And all they wanted to do was get pregnant by the, by, by the, the, by, um, the good dudes and turn them into crap porno thugs right 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 and the women thought that they were getting good dudes kings but no nah, we ended up with porno thugs exactly because this is what they look like porno thugs right in the end so they only wanted us for our money and babies and to lock us down right 2018 right november december energy right burning that midnight oil because that's what we was doing we was all up late at night we was all up from seven at night to eight in the morning right we was putting 13 hours i was reading cards 13 hours a day right i was down there in the dungeon right burning that midnight oil like crazy from 7 p.m to 8 9 a.m i was reading cards non-stop for the underworld right and they heard me all that time because they be up that time of night, right? Right. So, with that being stated, I was putting in that word, right? 
Right, I was putting in that work, and then eventually I just had to get entertaining and come up off of that whole situation because we figured it out. I mean, we knew that it was totally toxic. We knew that situation was toxic, right? But we were under a spell and under delusion and illusion, right? We were delusional because we thought we wanted the family too with the person. Nah, hell nah, hell, hell to the nah, we didn't, right? We were fighting with amongst ourselves, meaning I was fighting myself. Each of us was fighting ourselves. Like, I don't want this person, but why do I also want this with this person? I don't want this person. I was never looking for anything. I was just trying to chill. And when I tried to leave this person, next thing you know, next thing you know, when I try to leave this person, when I try to leave this person, I'm still trapped up with them. Right, my mind is trapped up with them. And I'm thinking about having a family and I don't even know or want this person. I don't want this person, but right they're making me feel like i need to be in their life nah it's because they're seducing me i don't want to be with them i'm crying out to god every night i'm talking to this group of people every night and we're trying to figure out why are we stuck in this situation with this person we're praying to god we're talking to each other we're reading cards with and to each other and we're not understanding why in the world do we want to be connected to this nasty thing this evil thing meaning the people we don't even want I mean, we found out they were nasty and evil after the fact. That's why I'm saying nasty and evil now. We thought they were decent people, but it was like, I don't want them. I'm not interested in them like that, but I'm talking family. Have I lost my mind? I'm talking legacy. Have I lost all of my shit? Right. 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 But there's this girl. She, 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 she blessing us. She, but we don't know who she is, though. Me, of course. Right. She blessing us, though. She brought us to a table, and she's feeding us the word. She's letting us know. She's helping us decipher what's really going on. Why are these people trying to hold us, right? Why are these people trying to hold us and have us married to them? We don't want them, right? These people are straight up trying to keep us in a relationship, talking about, right, no, they're trying to lead us down the wrong path. They're trying to lead us to temptation. We're trying to get away. So God sent us some woman who can decipher this very well. We're going to call her high priestess for now, but we know she's not evil, though. She's some type of high priestess, but she ain't evil. And she, she battling the evil for us and with us. She battling this divine masculine of hers. She's fighting with her divine masculine spiritually to set all of us free. Right. Because he's trying to take her down. And with her fighting with her divine masculine, we're finding out what's going on with ourselves as well. With, with this divine masculine, divine feminine stuff. Because it seemed like it was only supposed to be twin flame. What's this extra mess? It was supposed to be twin flame. What's this secret voodoo mess that's involved? No, nah, I don't want no voodoo for no love. I ain't trying to be under no spell for no love. Father God. Father God. You the one with that. Who the one with the Excalibur? Who who got the strength to break this? Who got the strength to pull this sword out? Cause something is wrong here. Something is wrong here. But this this woman, she's strong. Who is this woman that we talk to every single night for thirteen hours or better? Right. She breaking it down. She letting us know. No, nah, this ain't right. This sound like spell stuff. She talking to us and she trying to figure out herself. What's up? What's up? And at the same time, you know, she's trying to keep our spirits together. She's entertaining us through the cards as well. She's building relationships with us through the cards as well. This is 2018 November, December energy, right? This is a burning the midnight oil energy. And I was praying for everybody. This woman's praying. We hearing her pray. We seeing her pray, right? We we getting up out them cycles. It's taking a minute. It's take, we're letting the cycle as it go. We're learning what's going on with us through each cycle, through her and her readings. We're learning, we're learning, we're, 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 we're breaking away slowly but surely, surely, we're knowing that, uh-uh, we getting served by some nonsense, and she's serving us the good stuff, right, we don't want no, not love like that, we want the real true love, now, we don't want no Venus, right, we want the real love from God, right, and these women and men are breaking us down, Father God, so we praying and praying, for the good thing to come through, Father God. Where are you, Father God? Oh, uh, uh we are totally discombobulated, Father God. Why do we feel like we want to commit suicide, Father God? Help us, Father God. Help us, Father God. <sighs> Finally, that tower moment to relieve us from all of that madness, right? The Queen of Swords, right here, right? The Queen of Swords, right here. She helped break the leeches off of us. So there's nothing you can do to her. There's nothing you can do to her, right? We've been through it. We've been washed. We've been clean. We've been resurrected, right? Now it's you, your turn. We're not going to go there with you. This is your turn. 
you will get your recompense for celebrating as to how you put black magic on people, how you tried to take us down, how you did not allow us to live our life, right? We told you to go away, but every day we fighting because every day you hustling, right? Every, we're fighting every day against you guys because every day you guys are hustling. Right, you're broke, busted, disgusted, right? And we still have to fight you every single day, right? Us as the foot soldiers and Raffaello as the, right, the emperor, right? Right. And it ends with, right, the protectors, right? And it ends with the Templars and the emperor, Raffaello, right? Right, that was 2018. Burning the midnight oil energy, right? We got away, right? We cut ourselves free, right? And we must stand strong, right? If you want to go there, right? We cut ourselves free and we must stand strong. That's why we are kitty club and fox hounds and we don't play with none of y'all. And we will not play with none of y'all. And House of Cards also stands with us, right? They turn their backs too, away from embology, right? This is embology right here. This is embology. We got away from that. And you guys are so sad, so mad, so disgusted. Well, you didn't want to get washed with us. You did not want to get washed. You do not accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. And you know you do not. So that's why every day when you hustling, every day we, we, we slay y'all away with no problems. Right? And that's why you will continue to have these tower moments. Because you didn't want to be part of this legacy. That's why you're not. You didn't want to. You love to party and bullshit. And do all this spiritual shit. And that's why you are discombobulated. That's why you don't know what's going on. That's why you are Cujo Mops, right? You're rabbit dogs running around crazy. Trying to hang on to something spiritual. The good spiritual. But you can't have it. You can't have it. Your energy is not equipped for it. Because truthfully, all you want is eros. You just want that sex. You don't want the love of God. You don't. Adios. That was 2018, November, December energy. And if you truly want to take it there, that goes all the way up until, let's say, March of 2019. Right. Love you guys. And I don't say miss you guys because we we're all still rocking with each other. Right. We just elevated to different levels. Right. We upgraded. So hmm, let's see how long it takes for this to go. Smoke sash. Right.